What's going on? This is Joey Malinsky from ATP Productions. Today I am doing the firmware update on the Blackmagic Ursa Mini to include the black shading. I didn't know if that was a, a racial thing where I didn't get to hang out with black people anymore or the camera starts becoming Donald Trump or not. I'm really but rich. Hopefully it does what it says it does and fix the cross hatching in the blacks because that has been a problem since I bought the camera. The update is super freaking easy. You just put the lens cap on, hit one button, it takes like six milliseconds, and then you're good. What I did find is I did a series of shots before I did the firmware update, and then a series of shots afterwards. The color definitely changed. I didn't change the color temperature in the camera at all. It stayed at 4500 the whole time, but you can visually see a totally different color scheme. Now, I don't know if that's something that when I did the update it wiped some settings away or, or what. I don't know if that's the new color science because I liked the, the Blackmagic color science so hopefully that didn't affect the whole uh, visual image of the camera and just this cross hatching problem. As you can see from some of the clips, um, especially at 1600, the cross hatching pre-update was insanely bad. Afterward at 1600, still really bad. But you do see in this dark shot uh, of the hallway where um, it's not good, but it's definitely better than before because that thing was, you can just see it's just all over the place, uh, the cross hatching. I tried to do a, ver a variety of different kind of shots, and, but I want stuff that was underexposed on purpose. I also shot at 800 ISO and then 1600 ISO. Um, the 1600 is virtually unusable on the Black Magic. It looks like ass. So I do not recommend that at all. Hopefully this gives you a you know, an idea of what the update can do for the camera. It's definitely worth doing, um, but I'm still a little disappointed in that there's this cross hatching at all. I mean, it is gross. Like, I, I don't mind noise. I don't mind, you know, grain and that, that kind of noise because it's kind of like we're used to it, but this cross hatching looks just different than anybody else's noise and it's, and it's, and it's a problem for me. Um, maybe I'm using the camera wrong, I don't know, but you, think I am? Tell me. Tell me what I'm doing wrong. Alright.